Well, folks, if you're like me, you've got a blink system, um, and you decided you want to put some more cameras on there, which I have uh, decided because I got a message from uh, Blink saying, hey, they had a big sale on. So I decided to buy the big sale of uh, three cameras right here, and here it is, the box over here. It comes with uh, three cameras and a, a, a Blink um, module, which I don't need because I'm not setting up a separate system. I already have the system set up, which obviously you must or you wouldn't be watching this video. So I'm going to add another camera. I've already added two of the cameras. Uh, I'm going to add the third camera. So pull this out over here and bring it over here. And you can, if you like, of course, take all the plastic off. But the main thing you need to do is get the back off of this thing. And since you have a system already, um, you already know how to do this. So I'll get the back off and come back. Hmm. found it's a little difficult to get these out of there. Okay, the next thing you need to do is uh, bring up your Blink app right here. And you choose up here at the top a little plus. It says you want to add something. Yes, I do. I want to add a camera. So I'll do that. Then it's telling you to scan the QR code. So all you really have to do is pick your camera up and let it scan that thing and it's ready to go it's scanned it so it's looking for the camera now it really does need some juice so we'll take a couple of the batteries stick those in it's still looking and put that one in there so it's looking for the camera, and it should find it since I put the batteries in. It takes a few minutes to do this. I didn't measure it, but um, I, I don't think you have time to sing happy birthday to you. It's still looking. Okay, updating firmware. This seems to take just a little bit longer. I won't sing happy birthday for you. All right. Camera added successfully. Done. Doink. All right. And then we get this. The camera is down here. It's, it's looking at the tile right now. Uh, and it comes up with this kind of odd number. It doesn't really matter because uh, what you call it, is, as it turns out, because um, all you really need is the little thumbnail. So, and I'm going to take a thumbnail right now with this camera. Um, I'll put this up here where I'll take a picture of uh, that. Let's see. So I hit this down here, boink, like that. And there it is. I just took a picture of the the box up here that the stuff came in. All right, so now I know what that camera is taking and wherever I move it, because I haven't decided where I'm going to put this yet, um, I can use the thumbnail, which I've done up here on my other ones. All right, so here's thumbnail of my patio. So now I have um, the original set of cameras, the doorbell camera, indoor camera, and uh, three outdoor cameras. So now I have um, six outdoor cameras. I can cover my backyard much better for watching my dogs when we're not here, which is uh, the reason I did this. I, I really don't care about watching the inside of the house. We have a burglar alarm in case somebody actually gets in. Um, and I'll have a photograph of them on the outside I, once I set all these up. So it is very easy to add a camera. You can see it only takes a few minutes. Simple to do once you've got your system set up, which once again, I assume you have, or you wouldn't be watching how to add a couple cameras to my system. I'm done. 10-4, Roger, Rubber Ducky, over and out.